Hi there, it's Shamik MD. I'm going to speak about sage, the very flavorful herb that you can add to salads, dressings, juices, but it's much more than a flavor. It's very high anti-inflammatory food and a memory-boosting brain health food. Even a small amount of sage in studies have been shown to boost memory function. And there's a component in the Chinese variety of sage, the root, same component found in drugs used to treat Alzheimer's. So it might be a safer alternative to consider. Sage has been used for thousands of years to treat brain issues. And not only brain issues, but also boost the health of the brain by increasing the interconnectedness of it. One of the antioxidants in sage is called carsonic acid and it crosses the blood brain barrier and halts production of free radicals. It also increases production of glutathione which is a very powerful anti-aging antioxidant, which works by increasing blood flow to the brain. It does this by dilating the middle cerebral artery. You don't have to remember all that, but just remember it increases blood flow to the brain, which is great. And there's a lot of negative health conditions associated with low blood flow to the brain. Glutathione also has been used to treat all sorts of brain conditions from autism to Alzheimer's. So, you want glutathione in your system and you want sage in your system. You can incorporate it if you're making salad dressing at home, you know, olive oil, lemon, salt, pepper, vinegar, add some fresh sage or add it to lentils, tomatoes, um, put it in your juicer or just steep it in hot water and add some sweetener. Find a way that you enjoy. Remember, with health conditions, brain conditions or any other conditions, herbs are great but often there is a root cause and it's caused very often by common toxins so it's important to do cleanses and detoxes to get rid of what's the causing in the first place and add in herbs fresh herbs in your diet as a preventive measure to boost our own body system so down the line we don't have health conditions i hope this makes sense and i hope you learned something new shamakin d from shamakind.com